Today we have a ton of news here for Safemoon, so let's begin. So here we are on the Safemoon Twitter. So we have a couple new posts here saying just devs here, Safemoon wallet, and that's about it. So the devs are really hard working on the wall here which is just amazing to see and we have a cool post here from safe moon saying we are family we are safe moon we are you you are the community that made us thank you for all your patience kindness and understanding we will make a change and that's it those are the two posts we have in the last two days which is still pretty awesome to see that uh the devs are really hard working on the wallet and the safe moon team really does appreciate the community here which is just awesome to see but Again, let's go. Let's continue. We have a ton of updates for me to talk about. So, a post here from the Sa uh, Safe on Facebook page saying Safe on updates. So, most kept believing some still needed hope, but we never stopped pushing forward. We are Safe Moon and we will get through anything as a team and an army together. Android mainnet beta already activated and now ISO mainnet beta activated. So, boom. Awesome things are happening here to Safe Moon. So, let's so see what's main net. The last beta run on testnet, that means that the funder on your account wasn't real, so you play with some virtual money. This time, the beta is on the main net, so it so it's connected to the blockchain and the money and your funds are real all right so still technically beta just testing with real money easy exactly so final testing with real money real safe moon and that's about it so let's continue got more updates look at this guess what this is boom we got the buy button on the wallet says so here buy button mod test it's exactly that. Mods are testing right now. The real safe moon wallet, which is amazing with real coins. It says here, Apple Pay, thou shall receive. So Apple Pay enabled here with the wallet, which is awesome. It's just awesome to see that you'll be able to purchase safe moon with your credit card. And that's it through Apple Pay, it looks like. Maybe in even a different way, but we're going to see. We're going to see what's happening here. Oh, this is going to be amazing. It's going to be amazing that people will be able to buy the coin through the wallet here. This is what we've been waiting for. The buy button for the wallet. So let's continue. We have more information here. So this here FUD Busters. So this is a huge post series. Let's check it out saying 9% of FUD Busters want you to sell your safe moon because they want to buy it at a cheaper price. If until now you still doubt the credibility of the team and think they want to pull the rug while well, they could have done it when the market was at 7 billion, then this is madness. Why would someone put so much effort and hire people? Create an application, develop a website and meet with the governments in the Gambia, have uh, partnerships with payment gurus of wire, and they could have abandoned the project and run away with our funds in April. Do you really believe that the devs fully docs would put their credibility on the line if there was any malicious maneuver? Do you think the Gambia or Vara would have a partnership with scammers? Safe one is effing legit and let that sink in. So if anybody ever had like fud about safe to say that they're going to do rock pull, well, I think that fud has been destroyed a pretty long time, but just internet trolls are basically uh, trying to do more FUD because they want to purchase safe moon but at a cheaper price like this person said here this way they are creating FUD so they can buy safe moon at a cheaper price so later on when it does increase they're going to basically shield the coin they're going to promote the coin and of course the coin is going to go up so try not to make a decision about what other people think the way I don't really need to worry about their motivations that's it 90% okay yeah it basically is it basically is like that so let's continue this is a pretty awesome post we need to learn some new things about fuds <laughs> about why people are fudding here oh yeah this is awesome so it says here apple and safe when working together so Binance does not accept apple pay coinbase does not accept apple pay only since june 2021 coinbase does accept apple pay but only since june 2021 so basically a couple of months ago so safe moon does accept Apple Pay after six effing months. So let's see, waiting patiently for the actual wallet in my personal hands to confirm. That will be awesome. Tr uh, trust but verify safe moon to the moon. So see, if you look at some of the moderators YouTube uh, videos, they have some cool videos showing the main net wallet. So there you go. Just throw the mic down. No slam that mic. So awesome to see that safe moon did enable apple pay it's just a huge step forward for people to have easier access to purchase the coin here so let's continue 
we have even more yes we do so what let's talk what actually is saying here the uh the wallet buy button works and the fees for purchase a phone are huge so the fees are huge right now now why are the fees huge you can just see here the uh, ethereum exchange rate four thousand dollars here transaction fee network fee uh, purchase total $559. So it says your Ethereum fees are expected to be high. When they uh, support the BSC payments, then there'll be a different story for fees. Absolutely, Ethereum fees are ridiculous. Yep, the Ethereum gas is super high right now, and that's about it. It says by the time you buy the token from exchange, pay a fee, then travel to another exchange to convert also paying fees. It'll be a hell of a lot easier, cheaper, and stress-free. I will only be able to do it every other week, but it's nice to have non-stop shop. This, it wouldn't say it's cheaper, but people spend just as much the first few buys learning how to do it right. It's a huge step up for adoption. I agree on all points. You see the bigger picture. The whole point here is that this is going to change. So this is going to change. You have Apple Pay and credit card, so that's that's that's, that's just breaking the game. But it's because it's through Ethereum. This is why the the fees are super huge. If it was through BSC, so basically through the Binance Smart Chain, it would be a lot, a lot cheaper. So hopefully later on in the future, when Wire does enable BSC buys, then we'll be able to purchase saving for a lot cheaper in the future. So this one needs to happen. And that's something that's going to need time. And it's not SafeMoon's fault, it's basically it's just nothing. We have, they have to be patient. Like we have been patient for the last couple of months here, but that's about it. This is what needs to happen. Now I don't really know the fees for the Apple Pay, but we're gonna see that also when we do get the wallet, of course. Let's continue. If you have any more posts, yes, we do. So Safe Moon Sunday on Twitter. So this is huge. So instead of it being on Twitch, it's going to be on Twitter. That's the biggest update we have about the Safe Moon Sunday. Basically, every single time before we had the Safe Moon Sunday on Twitch, but now it's a little bit different. It's trying to do like on Twitter space, basically Twitter Live or something like that. So why are they doing this? It's because they have like the biggest following on on Twitter and it's the best place to actually do the live stream so hopefully it doesn't have any crashes because I don't know how that works but more people will just see the live stream and that's it that's why it could be a really good idea to do something like this now it could be even a bad idea because I know the most what we have is on Twitter but on Twitch we have really super fans but we're gonna see what's gonna happen with the live stream we're gonna have a lot more people but we're gonna have a lot more fun from those people so do remember that I think they're gonna be like a lot of hate comments so uh, do be aware you're gonna see just a lot of fun here. So somebody asks, will there also be a safe moon Sunday or is it cancelled? So now we're gonna have the safe moon. We are going to have the safe moon Sunday tomorrow. It's be it will be live on Twitter space. Says here, will there also be a safe moon Sunday or is it cancelled? Yeah, safe moon Sunday, I believe, is on Twitter this week instead of Twitch. As something new this week, then of a course mooncast after show follow on Discord. There you go. It's the Mooncast after show. <laughs> We're waiting for the Mooncast. Also, it's super cool to see what's been happening here to Safe Moon. And the this is a smart move actually. Because more people are gonna see Safe Moon there. Like you have to remember, we have one million followers here on Twitter. Maybe even more right now. Yeah, a million and thirty thousand. There you go. We, just, we got thirty-one thousand more than before, which is an insane number, of course. So a lot more people are just gonna see the coin, and that's the most important part. They're gonna see the update. So we can actually ch talk about the price here, what's been happening. In the end, still, here's civilization, not too many things here, and that's it. There's a ton of civilization here happening. Like, in the end, we did, ever since we did have this peak, we did go down now by 33%. But of course, as you can see, little by little, we are slowly going up indeed. So th this does actually look like a double bottom here, which is awesome. So double bottom, which should mean that we should be able to do something like this and then explode to the top side if this is a double bottom so if this is a double bottom if, if day traders do look at this it is just a huge indicator that this coin should be able to explode pretty soon here if we're looking at this but i do know that not a lot of day traders are trading with safe one here we're just not having a ton of volume it's mostly like hype it's this is how safe moon does work right now we don't really have like hundreds of millions of volume going through the coin right now it's because we're not really listing on like big exchanges and that's the biggest reason but hopefully when we see like layer two of safe moon like version two of safe moon i think uh, then we're gonna see massive amounts of exchanges adding safe moon hopefully that this is what i believe this is not a hundred percent true this is what i believe will happen here to safe moon and hopefully it will hopefully something like this will happen that 
it's just going to be a lot easier for exchanges to add SafeMoon and add those tokenomics with SafeMoon. This is the biggest reason why SafeMoon isn't listed in so many exchanges or like it's not listed in the last like, couple of months here. It's because they don't want to get listed on exchanges and not have those tokenomics. But if those exchanges do add those tokenomics, it's going to be a lot easier. And just having that version 2 is going to allow those exchanges to add the coin just a lot easier. So hopefully just because that we're going to see massive exchanges adding the coin and good things can start to happen here to safe one. Of course, the wallet also. And on the safe one Sunday, I think they should have talked about, uh, like I said, the version two, but I think it's going to be more about the wallet. If they do talk about version two, that's gonna be awesome also, but we're gonna see. I'm not too sure right now. I believe that it's gonna be focused a lot more on the wallet, but if they do talk about version two, that's gonna be amazing because really we really need the, that information about SafeMoon. I know we've been having delays because of the launch of the wallet, but it would still be awesome if SafeMoon could talk about the layer two, like the layer, the version two. So hopefully they will, and hopefully just because that, we're gonna see a little bit of price bump, at least like 20 to 30%, it all depends. But that's what mostly happens after an AMA, after a safe one AMA. We do increase by like 20%, maybe even like 30%. It all depends on how big the news, how good the news really are. Of course, we can even get rejected after that, but I don't think it's gonna happen. I think they're gonna just apologize for what happened with the launch, and uh, he's gonna, uh, I think John is going to take all the responsibility, which is going to be really good. If he does that, it's going to it's going to be just really good. If he doesn't, it's still be it's gonna be okay. But at least he needs to apologize publicly in the Safe Moon MA. And that's it. And we, it will be pretty cool if he did talk about like what actually happened here. Hopefully he does. It just would clear up a lot of air, a lot of FUD, and just help the coin in general in the future. Because destroying FUD is the best thing that John can do. He is the like CEO, he is somebody who needs to do it if we want these fudsters to get wrecked, basically. So, hopefully, after like I said, like after the AMA, we're gonna see that pump, we're gonna see that increase, and when the wallet does release, we're gonna see another increase here. So, patience for now, like I said, patience until we do see the wallet. If everything works okay, people are happy, it's gonna be amazing. Like I said, safe really has like the super fans people who are just going to stick with safe for the longest of times and just be there forever, basically. Who, just people who really enjoy and love safe moon. So, those are the people who are going to drive this coin to with some new highs, and that's it. Says so here, I saw this. What is this? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So all the coins who are added here. Oh, this looks amazing. Okay, buy button. Yeah, we got the buy the swap. We got the swap here. Add tokens. Amazing. This is how it's going to work. Yeah, this is just amazing. Oh, it's sending you to the. Oh, that's how it's gonna work. It's gonna send you to. Okay. Okay. So basically, when you press the buy button, it's actually a buy button that's connected with the wire payments but through the safe moon website that is a good workaround it is pretty weird i don't know if people are gonna like that but uh this is, this is amazing it's an amazing post i didn't really see this so there you go already have the wallet here you'll be able to purchase safe one if you do want so and yeah it looks pretty amazing for now so Hopefully we're gonna have the wallet pretty soon here and the good things are gonna start to happen. Your purchase limit is $1,000, so yes only. And verify yourself to purchase up to uh, $2,500 a day. So there you go. In the end guys, I'm not a financial advisor. If you do want to buy these coins, please do your own research first. If you did enjoy this video, it means so much to me. If you can like this video, comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video.